agent. I was cutting up. Sorry, she I was, was cutting bad. up. She had me laughing. Me too. Okay. Yeah, Lindy Let's... gave me a cool little cup. If everybody can see <laughs> real quick. Okay. Yes, Alan Jordan. But then I'm gonna yeah. turn turn it around because I'm being ugly. <laughs> <laughs> and if you know, you know, you watched the earlier one. Candy, you couldn't be ugly if you tried. Nope. She couldn't. I don't know. <laughs> okay, y'all, uh, y'all on the tater bugging page. Just give me one second. It, my phone just decided it wanted to act ugly today, and uh, and we're not going on my page. Ooh, there we are. Big. Hey, Sandy and Darlene. Thank you. Okay. All right. Now, now, now. All right. Now she can see all of them, me. and I won't be able to see very far because uh, <laughs> one thing, it's like blue lettering. <laughs> oh, I can't see. Doesn't it look like blue? Girl, how can you Girl, I don't see letters? I can't see it. I can't see what's A little there. bit. Okay, I can see on mine though. Ooh, Lord. I, <laughs> oh, convertible, <laughs> convertible hair don't care, right, y'all? Oh, oh, Jesus, my. there's a five. Remember that video? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Patty. Hey, Carrie. So, is it Patty Willard, Patty? Patty, well, uh, uh, Wofford. I'm oh, sorry, right. I've got to get my contacts to get in the right spot. Let me make the. Hey. There's Trudy and Lori's here. Okay, so we're getting some folks here. Um, in case you have been under a rock, <laughs> <laughs> this is Tanya from Hummingbird Paintery and Elizabeth from Hi, Ellie's guys. Attic. And um, this is our little, we're just calling it a little mini event. Uh, Wanda's asking me who my friends are. So, yeah, there you go, hey, Wanda. Wanda. Be sure to go Liz follow Liz. their pages because we have our uh, inaugural event next Saturday, a week from today. And uh, we've got a fun lineup of ladies. Hey, everybody. Everybody's getting here. Frida, Terry, hey, Nicole, Jill, and Carol. Um... Great view today. Good, Carrie. Good, good, good. Hey, Karen. I think the three fit at the table perfect. Yeah. <laughs> and we do it this way. And I come in here because there's not, there's nowhere to go in my studio that way. So we can all pull you back so you can see all three of us. And Tanya's going to show us. She's got some great, she does wood cutouts. And she's got some great things to show y'all. And she's going to teach us how to paint these wood pieces. Two different ways, and you can, if you end up liking these, let me go on and say this right away, um, you can get these kits from Hummingbird Paintery, you just have to go to her business page, and um, send her a message. Look at our pretty colors all Isn't it fun? I can't quite get, every time I look down there and it's bigger, I can't quite get past my hair. I don't know when that had the hair going like. <laughs> yeah, it out the was. back. It really was. It really was. Oh. I was just thinking it was really long doing that. Thank time. you, Cindy, for putting these links down. I want everybody to follow these. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you, Cindy. They're incredibly talented, and um, we'll, you'll be seeing our lineup for next Saturday. You've probably seen it already, um, floating around. And I'm so glad, Tony. Good. Watching Hummingbird Paintery on my phone and Tater Buggin' on my iPad. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hey, Thank Yogi. you. Y'all are so sweet about us being on the trip. I am too, Terry. I didn't know you were going on the uh, Sparkle Chicks. You're going Terry Chisholm? Yeah, we're all going to be there. Yeah. All three of us are going, and we are so excited. So we get to hug everybody's neck. Exactly. Hey, Tammy. Okay. Hey, Jane. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So we're going to get started. Turn it okay? over to Tanya. Um, I cut out these pieces here. Um, I got some three quarter inch plywood and I cut out the body and part of the hat for the cowboy. Um, and then you've got different pieces that go on front to make him the cowboy that he is. So I've got this little piece right here and this is the brim of the hat. And we're going to put it about right in here. And then we've got both of our mustache pieces right here. And they're going to go here and a little bitty piece for the nose. And that is the same thing that I did on my live for what Elizabeth is doing over here. But she's staining hers. And this is the Uncle Sam. It's 
kind of stainy. Sure, it's okay. What was so cool is Tanya did this live and Elizabeth commented on it. That would make a really cute cowboy. Because he looks like Sam Elliott with that mustache. Yeah, and I said, oh my goodness, my stepdad would love that. He loves anything cowboy. And so this is going to be his father's, one of his father's days. Father, father That's all you make. Words. Words all day. <laughs> I think what I'm going to do is, while well, you guys are working on the cowboy since she's already taught the cowboy, I'm just going to be doing the pieces of my Uncle Sam and just minding my own thing, and I'll hang out over here, and then if somebody wants to see what I'm doing, I'll be glad to show them. Perfect. Because this, okay, the, this is the cool new thing, right? Yeah, she's right, never done the cowboy, cowboy live. Cowboy live. Yeah. And she did, if you want to see how she did um, the Uncle Sam, watch her replay. And I was about to what there was some, And then stick around because they brought some things to show. Did you? No, you didn't tell me to, but that's okay. They've okay. seen my they've seen my stuff. It's all good. We all we got <laughs> stuff to show you. I brought Tanya a couple brought little her things. stuff and that's what matters. A little a couple little things. Hey Pat. Okay, so we've got different size brushes here. When you're painting the main piece, you want to get a bigger brush so you can, you know, do it a lot easier and a lot quicker. Um and what I'll do is start with the hat. If you want a brown hat for your cowboy, um, then you just pick whichever color you want. I've got brown oxide and I use that a lot. And then we'll use the burnt umber. Both of these are from Apple Barrel. If you do want to get this paint and try this yourself. Um, and you've also need some creamy, color, creamy peach color for the face. Okay, and I always take the white and I mix it with the peachy color because I like it a little bit lighter color. And I've got a paintbrush here. I'm going to go ahead and do the face first. You want some? <laughs> May I yes. You have to use some hot sauce. <laughs> There's plenty. Because I've got okay. a lot. I'm learning from you today, <laughs> sister. Right. Yes. Okay. So. I just pick where I want my hat, okay? And I think that's basically what the cowboy hat looks like. So we're going to take this and kind of form where our face is gonna be. And that's the way I did it on my other one. So I just kind of looked at this, so you can just put it wherever you want to. Um, and then I'm just taking this and I'm gonna lift it up a little bit and do just straight across. Okay, once you get your one little line, you can take it apart. And then we're just going to go as far or as big as we want our face. And then I just went down. And she can do the peach or she can do peach with white. Either one. Because Lindy's going to do her thing. Mine's going to be mine's going to be a little more tan. Well, there you go. And you might want some brown for that. <laughs> <laughs> Since that is the color of tan. Exactly. <laughs> I will tell y'all what I'm finding hilarious right now, and of course I'm here for the comic relief. Tanya <laughs> is so business when we get the camera going. And we start <laughs> I mean, she, the Tanya at the Sonic and the Tanya here. <laughs> Two different Tanyas. Y'all. Just gonna say. You gotta watch that video. She had me in stitches. Yep. She had all of us in stitches. <laughs> Yep, it's on the tater bugging page, y'all. It's okay. It. Oh, <laughs> I should be watching what I'm doing. It's okay. <laughs> you're going to make your whole thing? I She's like, you're going to still get an A because you're so pretty. <laughs> I can't even do that right. It's okay. <laughs> I've got to watch my teacher. Oh. So we need to make just kind of like a smiley face almost. This is going to be the, the face, okay? <laughs> And then we're going to have the top where the hat is up here. So once we get our face on there, the rest of it is going to be the brown color. And I want the hat to be a little bit lighter. You can do whatever you want to. You can do a black one like <laughs> black, <laughs> like um, rip. Yellowstone Rip. Yes. So oh, rip. I know. Rip's something else, isn't he? He's kind of pretty. He is pretty. So I'm going to get a little bit of black here. You paint so fancy. So you just did one, you did a little dot on the outside and did a little, okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. I, I want to, I want to, I have a way I shade 
and I love the way Tanya does it, so I want to do everything the way Tanya did it today. <laughs> she can do whatever she I'll wants to. I'll go back though. to my old way another time, yeah. but I want to do it this way. Oh, and I can't see up close, y'all. I've got my contacts in, but let me just... See, you make it look so... I've seen other painters do it where they just get a little smidge on the outside. I don't know. I don't do good with that. Really? See, yours how do just you goes do? right there. No, how do you do it? I don't even know. <laughs> I'm just pouring some the different color beiges or browns on here. We're going like to show you, Rita. You. I'm sorry. We're going to hold it up and show y'all what we're doing. Right now, this is what it's going to look like, okay? It's supposed to be just a round little face there because we're going to cover up the top of the head. Uh, right there, or the forehead, I should say. How did it get stuck on me? <laughs> All right, but I'll just paint over my face where I messed up. T Tanya's paint, water, and brushes are blocking the view. Oh, okay. Okay, do I'm sorry. God, Tanya. I know, right? Come on now. Okay. <laughs> Mr. T is probably smart and staying out of <laughs> this mess. Yes, Sarah. He is. He's next door in the in the other mess. In the other mess, up in the shop. Tanya got to go up in the shop with him. Please bring things up close to the camera. We'll do the, we'll do that the best we can, Lori. Oh, <laughs> Speak of the devil and he shall appear. They were just talking about you. Staying out of the mess. I'm not here. Who are you? You don't even know. Now, I took a little bit of the brown and I did towards the edge. And then I didn't rinse my brush like you need to. <laughs> so I had to put some more of the peachy color on there. But you want it to be on the edge of it. It's okay. <laughs> She's kissing. Okay. <laughs> and you also want to do your nose the peachy color. That way it can dry. And I'm just gonna hold it a little bit, put the peach and the white together, and then I do the sides first. Hey, Wendy Lee. Yes. Do you have a sanding block out in your shop? Keep up, Elizabeth. I'm doing my own thing over here, Mr. T. Yeah, she is. So, um, you, you know. You do grab us and a I know you, no, 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 no. I'll go get it. I just He knows it. right where it is. So that's what you get for being smarty to me. <laughs> <laughs> Friend. And then I take the edge of it, and I'm going to paint the edge a darker color. The brown. Well, I'm so behind. I yeah, apparently am too. I didn't realize we were doing the nose. I, of course, I've kind of done. Well, it's just because it's the same color as the face. Well, you know, that's logic and it makes sense to me. Thank, Thank you, you my friend. It goes over there. That would be me. All right. So Thank this you, is what love. it looks like and it's got the brown right around the edges. But this way it can dry over here. Set it aside. And set it aside. <laughs> Who says that? Set it right. Set, set it aside. aside. Set it, set it aside. aside. When Amanda says it, like Gerald, I get so tickled. It's so cute. Set it aside. Is Amanda here? Amanda, are you here? She might not be. What is Elizabeth doing? Show us. Tammy said. Absolutely not. I'm not going to show you. <laughs> show us. Um, I am doing just an Uncle Sam, but what I've done is I stained the wood, and I'm kind of just doing the same color scheme that I did the other night. I am nowhere near as artistic as these beautiful ladies here. There will probably be zero shading happening on mine because I'm not that talented. Look at you go, girl. Well, I'm She's just trying just to, I'm just blood. taking the color that I'm going to do. Not everybody goes as fast as I do. It's okay. So, um, I'm taking the brown, okay, and we're going to just put That's some white with it because shadow. I want it to be a little bit lighter up here than I do for his beard. I want him to have a little bit darker beard, so I'm going to use the regular brown color for the beard and just get the white and the brown together and do for the hat. <laughs> Jody said she wants to come down for a paint party when, when it's... <laughs> but it's a terrible place here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Jody. <laughs> I just was... meant because it's 
July, I mean June, not you July. You can't back June. that. You've already said it. You've been saying it. Well, it's true. It. <laughs> well, my brother lives in near Portland, Oregon. Uh, my nose just looks dirty. <laughs> just dirty. <laughs> Oh well, it's fun. It's, it's all fun. good. It's all right. It's all good. We're painting you know, the I'm doing the sides first because it's a lot easier to paint the sides. Did you mix some white or peach in with that? I missed that. White and the brown. And you're just painting the whole sides the same color. You're not using like the colors of whatever you're painting. I am doing the. the Angela's same here from Word and Home. Hey, my friend. If I'd shut hey, up and it would be better. Okay, well, really, I'm not teaching all that well. <laughs> I'm just doing it down to where the head, the face is, and where you're going to put the brim of the hat. I'm only going down that far with the lighter color beige. I'm doing And then we will do the darker color beige for the rest of it. i got to do this right for my stepdaddy now. He, he's proud of me. I can't let him down. Of course he no is. No matter what, you're going to do great. Now, that was very teacher-like. It was good. Thank she you. went back into professional Tanya mode. Yes, where's Sonic Girl? <laughs> <laughs> Crazy Sonic Girl was here. Where's the Sonic Girl? <sighs> and sometimes I get a little bit of water because then it'll act like stain. It'll make your paint go a lot, lot further. If you put a little bit of water with your paint for the edges, especially because with this particular wood, it kind of soaks up the paint. I've noticed it does soak up the paint. And so, if you take the water, then it'll it'll spread it a lot more. She's right, ladies. It does. It does make it like a stain. Mm -hmm. That's cool. It just goes along goes a lot further. Um, Angela, we were talking earlier about y'all's event coming up this Friday and how cool that's going to be. That's going to be so much fun to watch y'all do the um, the Goodwill thrift, or Royal thrift store um, swap. challenge swap thing. Yeah, that's fun. That's the Simple Treasures girls. And of course our event is Saturday. Nice segue, Wendy. Yes, thank you. Yeah, I guess we should mention that, too. <clears throat> I hope y'all are going to be able to join us Saturday. Have y'all joined uh, the Memphis Bells Creative Circle group yet? Be sure to go over there. We had 157 members. Wow. Yay. Yay. So glad. I know. I'm so excited. Excited, excited. It's going to be fun, and that's just where you can... We'll share the um, videos from all, all there, too. I'll be watching your event, too. Thank you, paint. Angela. Paint. Bring but one bottle. I'll go get whatever we need out there in the studio. You have brown oxide? Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I, got, I had a brown that'll work, I'm I'll sure. We can, we, can, we can make it happen. It'll just I have a different color hat or something. I don't know. Is right. the brown oxide the darker? Or no, the it's okay. the one. Yeah, it's this one. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll I'm get trying, one. I'm trying to get enough of this. So Save me a know. place at the table. Be right over for the fun. Come on, Elaine. Yeah, come Who's on. Who's the with lady us. in the middle? Shar. This yeah. is Tanya. Hey. From Hummingbird Paintery. Hey there. She's uh, right here in Bartlett, where I live. And um, she has her own page, and these are her amazing woodcuts that she does. No, y'all, she does it all herself. Plus, she <laughs> works full time. Which is awesome to me. So Obviously. awesome. And works full time. And, um, yeah, so you need to go follow her page. And Ellie's Attic. That's me. That's Ellie's Attic. Um, I'm going to go see if I can find a... a Pink color that's kind of like that. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. So right now I'm just uh, painting the beard on. Right now it looks funny, okay, because I've done half of it, and then I've done the face, and then we're doing the brown, the darker brown at the bottom. 
Now I also have the darker brown, which is the burnt umber, and that's the really dark brown. That's about as bright as I can get, the darkest, I should say, not brightest, but darkest paint that I can get. So we'll be using that on the edge. I think we've got enough. I don't think she'll. Well, you've got her on a wall goose chest then. That'll be fun. Oh, right. Well, maybe. You may or may not. We can talk about her. We can talk about her? Yeah. Fine. We love her. <laughs> okay. Do either one of these compare? Yeah. Looks like to me, that looks like the same, but that's Americana. Okay, so, so you could use that. If you don't have anything else and you've got Americana dark chocolate, that'll work. Yeah, just that's any my kind favorite. of medium brown. Brown is that uh, dark chocolate. The dark chocolate, I'm on about my third little container of it. There's one too, I think it's called Java or Coffee Bean or something. I can't remember. I like it too. But. I have a big, uh, you can only find it in the big size, and it's Anita's, and it's a... Uh, is it coffee or? That might be it. And that's what I use for my shading on my faces all the time. That might be why I know it, because I took your classes. Oh, yeah. She's already, hers looks so good. <laughs> yes, <laughs> looks, <laughs> I'm a little sloppy. That's okay, and she had to go get the paint, so. Would you say, Penny, that's one, Lindy? Oh, for getting up? For yes. Getting up. Hey, Iris. Iris, have you met these two sweet ladies before? I believe you have. Tanya from Hummingbird Paintery and hey, Iris. Hey, Elizabeth Iris. from Ellie's Attic. We're awful quiet. Yeah. There's food I'm on the table. Or at, well, I'm trying to get really close to the edge here. And we I were, just don't want to go in the face. Hey, Francis. We uh, were so loud at Sonic. <laughs> Has anybody ever gotten kicked out of Sonic? I mean, <laughs> y'all, they hooted at Daniel as we were driving away. I know he was probably thinking, what? And I'm in a very conspicuous car. So Daniel will be driving around Bartlett now one day and see that car and go, <laughs> Oh, there's that crazy lady. No, oh, I gotta run. Mama. <laughs> oh, Mama, there they are. <laughs> Those crazy women. Poor little fella. I know. Poor You're thing. so sweet, Melissa. Melissa, Melissa's my here. friend. Oh, look, you've already. Did I make too long of a face? No, you did good. Okay. See, I think that's I made my sense. face too long too, but you know what? It's all right. Oh, we're gonna. It's, it's gonna all be all gonna right. be good because that's gonna. Cause everybody's are gonna have their own little person. Yeah, that's what we always say. You could put three, um, three spins on one thing. Thank you. What she said. What she said. All do the very same thing, and they all look a little bit different. Always. And if you do it, you're going to have it a little bit different, too. They're going to look basically the same, but they're different. And if y'all want, if you missed it, if y'all want um, one of these kits for a cowboy or an Uncle Sam, just message Tanya at Hummingbird Paintery. She does sell these. She sells some really cute stuff. Her animals and her... Um, Oh, goodness, you should go watch her last auction and see all of the things. Oh, my goodness. That's so cute. On the little characters I've been making lately, those little bitty bees and yes. ladybugs. She, I love the ladybug. Or is it the ladybug in the lemonade stand? Yes. Oh, she's so cute. Well, when she... Oh, it was a fly. Um, <laughs> she... <laughs> Kamikaze in my face. Um, the other night, I was watching her, and she was doing a ladybug that was um, sitting by a watermelon, and she put teeth on that ladybug, and I thought I was going to die. It's so funny. Pam, we were saying that Tanya has gone into um, teaching mode now, and she's not Sonic Tanya. So you're saying, are y'all behaving yourself now? She's much more subdued. Oh, yeah, I, I know I don't you know can't, what Lori, saying. I've been and I'm so sorry. The whole day. That's right. <laughs> uh, Lori, I understand. We're going to, we're, you know, it's hard with camera angles and all that and fitting three people, but we're going to hold it up here in just a second. I'll show you where I am. And Tanya has been showing you where she is on hers. And I'm just here 
because they needed an extra person. That's and I'm just not doing the extra. true. <laughs> so mine is the last thing we'll see because I'm just redoing what Tanya's already done. Because she showed it to us the other day. She did it live and, um, you know, I, Elizabeth didn't need a cowboy. But it I was mean, her I do, idea. I it would, was her I idea. would take a cowboy, but he'd have to be Rip or Kevin Costner. <laughs> or, or me you too. Said, what? I mean, <laughs> me you too. said I didn't need a cowboy. Well, well need I need him. You know, let's define that sentence because I can not... ride that cowboy. <laughs> See what we mean? That's the girl. There's Sonic Tanya. She's back. I, I'm just over here painting, and it just flinged by me, and I was like, what? I knew I should get her to do it. <laughs> oh, Jody, a lot is going on now. You got here at just the right time. There's Pat. Hey, Pat. That's hey, pro Pat. professional Tanya. Yes, this is professional Tanya, and then she oh, talks sweet. about cowboys, and she goes back to... Uh, Sonic Tanya. Sonic Tanya. Let's call her that. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Minnie. <laughs> Good to see everybody. Yeah. Thanks for hanging out this with us fun. today. This is fun. This was kind of last minute, and um, we just wanted to do a little something fun. It's really hot here today, and they're close by. Elizabeth's in Germantown, if you're familiar with this area, and Tanya's like a hop, skip, and a jump here in Bartlett. What are you, a minute? You know, like five minutes. That time I was doing the um, black glue project, mm -hmm. the doorbell rang. Gerald went to the door while I was live. Tanya had dropped off a little thing that made it so much easier for me <laughs> to do it. Literally, <laughs> she was watching me. That was so and sweet. And ran it right over. It was so sweet. I'm not putting eyes on them. You don't have to. I like him like that. Look. I want to do your eyes. I like the way. I like him just looking a little. Um, Oh, that looks great! You gotta like show it. them. That looks yeah. really glue, rustic. I'm gonna glue it together, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna step aside. What y'all will find out about? That she's scared. Scared? Scared of eyeballs? Mm -hmm. I am a little scared. What of you'll eyes. find out about Ellie's attic is she marches to her own drum, <laughs> and I think that's so cool. You know, she's not afraid to go her own way. With um, I did ask permission from the teacher though before because she kind of oh, gave me a look, yeah. and I said. Uh, are you okay if I do it that way? She goes, uh, yeah, I guess if you have to. You know, <laughs> you know you've got to be you. I know you got to do things your own way. Hey, That's Terry. Right. Um, Y'all know Rip is my boyfriend, right? That's no, Opa. No, sorry. Opa, I was wondering no. if you were here and you were going to. I, I think know. Rip gets around, is my opinion. He's I think we all boyfriend, like him. too. I'm a Kevin Costner girl, I'm so a, I'm, a little, let him have I'm not going to kick either one of them Me out. Either. But, Just saying. You know, when Mr. T puts on his, he's got a Kevin Costner jacket. I'm okay, like, now. Well, that's a little too much information okay. for us. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't hang with you, too. We won't be able to look at Gerald the same I way. I can't hang with you, too. <sighs> we love you, though. I know. Y'all let me hang out. I'm trying to do the sides first. I tell you, it's a lot easier to do your sides of everything that you're going to paint. But will there be color. bling, Ellie? I yeah. have a piece of bling here. Oh, she brought I have actually thought about it. Yeah. It wouldn't be Ellie's without a little bit of bling. I um I did not bring diamond dust because I did not want to make your house yes. crazy. But I have diamond dust. I'm not, I'm not I, afraid I'm of it. I'm actually I, there's no diamond dust in my plan. I've always been really vanilla and um then, you know, I don't know, lately I've been y'all have been Going outside the box. Go, yeah, yeah, I've been blinging a little bit, and I'm not hating it at well, you all. You know, I'm a bad influence on you. Uh, is that all right? I've heard. Okay. Well, that's I'm true. Sure that's true. <laughs> <laughs> all right now, Tanya. Between you and Tanya, I'm gonna be ruined. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Far. All right. <laughs> Did I blush, Jody? Oh, me. Yeah, these two girls. And Tanya, I'm telling you. Do we have you, this on? It is on, right? Yeah, it I mean, is on. You paint. So uh, I'm just over here. I'm just on the mustache, and she's gone on. I mean, on the brim of the hat, and she's always. Oh, 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 can't even talk. Easy either. for you to say. Yeah. I haven't been able to talk all day. Never blinged in your whole life until now. I, yeah. Ellie is. Um, 
absolutely influencing influencing a lot of us in a good way well the bad thing is ladies it could change because that's part of my deal is i do things and then i find something new well that's so, kind of how i do too i know what you mean so there could be a new there could be something new coming down the road you never know i'm down never for know. it I have to try all the things, you know. I had to try neurographic art. I had to try. I love that neurographic art. I do too. I love mixed media. I love trying new um, uh, art supplies to see how they work. I just want to try all the things. So I'm just kind of putting some of the darker color in with the lighter color, so it'll kind of go together. I'm just using it, instead of going on the edge, I'm just kind of going all over it, so I'll show y'all. You don't have to do this, you can do whatever you want to. That's the way I feel about it too. Yeah, that was so hard. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Mr. T needs to model his jacket. <laughs> One day I'll get See, they out. already all have a crush on me, so you've <laughs> given them now new material. Y'all really do make him blush, I'm telling you. He's funny. Yeah, when I came in today, like. I told him how handsome he was, and he started looking around for somebody. He goes, did somebody sneak in with me? <laughs> right. the sweetest man. So just kind of like some... Mm -hmm. like, I just swirled a little bit of the darker color in the lighter color gotcha. because you've got such a dark beard. You want the mustache to stand out, so you want it a little bit lighter. And you want some of the brown to come into it. So if you want brown, you can always do black. You can do white. It doesn't doesn't matter. Do they ever have red-headed cowboys? I'm sure they do, but... That's my favorite thing. <laughs> I ate out. <laughs> Brown is good. Or rip. Rip is good. No, rip. Like. My cowboy is rip. <laughs> She's saying there are no others. If Rip's hair turns red, then she'll take a red-headed cowboy. But not until then. <laughs> Isn't he red-headed in real life, I think? I think he is a little red-headed. Yeah. Which that Oh, I forgot my little stars. But you know what? I'm, Thank you, Pat. Yes, absolutely. I'm going to do more to those stars. I'm not, excuse me. And you want a little bit of water on here. I'm taking it and going next to the, the face, even into it just a little bit. You don't have to do this part. Look at you, Rudy. Did you take my seat? Metallic watercolors. Yes, I have some. They are very cool, aren't they? Do Ru Rudy, Rudy's our seat? guest, our hey, guest Rudy. crafter now. How you doing? I have a, a person here. See? A baby. Oh, look. It's my Aunt Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> Aunt Kitty just called. Yeah. She's calling for you. I think she's calling for you. <laughs> right as the cat gets up there, that's kind she's of funny. Calling it is you, funny. Rudy. Her name's Catherine, but we call her Kitty. I think I love the same. Kitty. I think that's pretty. Now I'm just taking the darker color and going on the side of the beard here, just so it'll kind of outline that. I didn't quite get what you were doing with the water. You, did you take right a little bit of water and put on there so you can make it float on there. The hey guys, I'm really close. Y'all didn't see me just put my face in front of the camera, did you? Kind of on the side. Do some of the I think they've decided to ignore me. And now do it. But you have to get your paint. Take your paint and do like this. Oh, mercy. Y'all, she's a real painter. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just this self-taught goof over here let's see here okay well we're floating now yes floating floating tanya did you take lessons somewhere or did you self -taught? oh that's a good question yeah i'll, I'll ask some questions from please do yeah. interview mm -hmm. tanya. Of course. so tanya tell us about how you felt actually a friend place. of mine showed me how to do this the floating so to okay. speak 
Did you use burnt umber? I did. It? Oh, burnt that's umber. why it's not showing. I'm yeah. on it now. Burnt umber. Mm -hmm. The darker color. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> did you hear how she said that? Oh, that was Sonic that's Tanya. So cute. Oh, that's so cute. You live in a horrible place. <laughs> Give Rudy a paintbrush. He's got one. It's his tail. He says, <laughs> I got the paintbrush. Right. I got the best paintbrush of all. Now I'm learning to float. Look Sweet. at me float. It's good. You're good. Did you float the other side next to his face? I or? did. Okay. I did We're going to float that too. Mm -hmm. Just make it look a little darker. I'm going to go over it again. She did not go to school with us. Tanya, where'd you go to school? I went to Kingsbury High School. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. No, we're so you did not take art lessons? I did not take art lessons. I did take one watercolor lesson. I was telling the people in my group. And um, she passed away. Oh. She. Where did you take that at? Um, private lesson? Yeah, you? just a private lesson from her. And I'm just taking a little bit more, and we're just going to take this and kind of go up and down here. I'm just showing y'all where I am now. I haven't really shown mine. It's not Tanya. No, I'm, I'm going to watch them now because I am in awe of their painting. Tell Jody Santana what floating looks like. Hey, Jermaine. Okay. Um, what it is, you're floating a color on the outside. If you paint like this right here, sorry. No, uh -uh, I'm watching. Like a beige color right here that I've painted. Then you take a darker color and go on the edge. You float the color with the water on the edge. And you take just a little bit on the outside of your flat brush. And you, you go down the edge. And that's what floating is. And does that create an outline? It kind of creates an outline. And you can also float the color on like I did here and just put some extra paint color on Do you want me to take that there. up to the camera so they can see it? Certainly. I'll be glad to. I'll take it to both cameras. I like that floating method. That's There's pretty. this one. And I'm going to come up and show you here. There we go. Don't look at my fingernails though because they're terrible. I'm going to do the same thing to the hat, okay? I'm still going to use the darker color. You can use the lighter color of the brown and do it because it's still darker than what the background is. And sometimes I have to get a little more water. Sometimes I have to take some away because it'll be too wet. So there's kind of a happy medium here. See how it outlines the edge of it, and the other side doesn't have that. Andrew, I used to watch Desperate Housewives all the time. Ooh. I watched all of them. Why are they yeah. talking about Desperate Housewives? I, know. I don't know. I just looked up, and Andrew was talking about it, and so I was had to chime in because I did like that show. I liked that show too. I forgot about it. I, I did too. too. I remember when it came out too. It was so different than anything else that was on TV. I'm yes. sitting on my foot, so I look like I'm eight feet tall. There we go. <laughs> um, it was so different, and everybody was like, "Oh my God, this is the best show ever!" And it was pretty good. It's pretty good. It was kind of quirky. Yep. I liked Terry Hatcher. Me too. That's what got me to watch it in the first place. I liked her. Oh, Connie, you're so sweet. Also yes. called shading. Yes, 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 yes. It is shading. The floating is shading? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I get it. I always love learning new techniques in doing stuff, and so this is so fun. I just like watching you up close painting. That's amazing. I know. She's, yeah, I've seen her on camera, but never, she's great. She is. Oh, shoot. You floated, you floated on the hat, too. I got to float on the hat. Yeah, I did it on the hat. <laughs> I'm so fun. See, I'm not an artist. <laughs> so I'm not either. I don't have to float anything. I just not did not. <laughs> I like hers a lot more. Hey, Rula. You still watch it, Andrew? Yeah, it is good. I don't, this could be is not it still on? Or is no, it is it? Put your boy in more. <laughs> have either one of them. <laughs> Don't you have a wolf? Anybody thinking about oh, ordering so a cowboy or Uncle Sam kit? I'm telling you, I think the cowboy is great. 
You know, what kills me is I was on the live that she was doing the Uncle Sam, and you're like, ooh, that'd make a cool cowboy. And bam, next thing I know, she's got a cowboy going. And I'm like, ooh. Mm, it, and it was because of the handlebar sense. mustache. I just went, oh, my gosh, I can totally see a cowboy out of that, too. Yeah. He's cute. I'll let you finish. I'm going to let Lindy well, I'll be here till midnight. Oh. I'm going to let you finish what you're doing. Regina said, Elizabeth, are you not painting? I've actually finished my project, she but I finished. want to wait until... They're finished and we'll show them all at the same time because part of this was kind of how you can take these kits and everybody's got a different take on it. And of course, we all know my take is gonna be completely different because my style is a little different. So, um, but that's what it's about. I yeah. love that. And that's what's cool about it. If you see it and you see what Tanya's doing and you're thinking, I'm not that feeling I'm that good yet with a paintbrush. <laughs> You can see what I'm doing, and then you'll say, okay, well, I can do that with a paintbrush, so. Exactly. Yeah. There are lots of ways to do things. Yep. I forgot my blush. I could put some blush on it. Enough blush to blush everybody watching this right now. Yeah, I love <laughs> blush. I was, we don't really have to put blush on him, but. I, I love that touch, though. I love when you do that. And Me, too. It makes it come alive <clears throat> in your eyes. Too. Yes. Several years ago, I, uh. Was I did Ipsy and Birch Fox, so. Oh, I did too. I loved it, but it's, you know, enough is enough. You can't. Yeah, I'm doing the Fab Fit Fun Fox Oh, now. I've always toyed with that. I've never done um, it, though. I, the yeah. first year I did it was amazing, and now I'm on the second year, and I'm starting to get some repeats of things. Oh. Not by their fault. I think they're just, you know, recycled through the next phase of it, and I might pause it for a little bit, but they... The thing about that box is everything is a full size and it's like housewares and stuff too. I've gotten some really cool Ray Dunn cups and oh, nice. picnic blankets and pillows for the house and just some cool stuff. Do you need me to get you anything? Mm -hmm. Ma'am, we're all good? Mm -hmm. We're good. I've just got to catch up. I want to, uh, I want to make mine look a little bit better. I like the cowboys. Yeah, this is fun. I think my stepdad will reread all of his uh, paperback westerns. He loves western movies. Does he read Louis L'Amour? Oh, he has every Louis L'Amour book there is, and I and John Grisham. So his other really? Father's wow. Day is um, the new John Grisham book. He has a new book out. He does, and he's got two. Uh, well, Mom got him the newest one, and then. I did a little research, and his birthday's in August, and there's book number one in a new series that just came out before this newest one, and the next two come out in August, so I'll be able to get him the next two That's for his perfect. birthday. That's perfect. Yeah. That'd be great. That is another Memphis connection. John Grisham is from our area. Absolutely, yes. He went to high school right down the street from where we went to high school, Lindy. Where did he go? At South Haven. Really? Oh, he went to South Haven. Oh, oh I think that's so. where I lived. And he graduated. Any about our age? He's older. I think oh. he's the same age as um, Johnny Adams, so I think that would be like class of 80. I was going to say, who was Johnny Adams? Another guy from South Haven that I know. Okay. She knew everybody. <laughs> that's not didn't true. I didn't know. I don't know any of those people. <laughs> except John Grisham. Only I don't so know him. She don't know him. John Grisham. Either. But you you know what? If you saw him, I bet you'd go, Hey, John Grisham! I <laughs> would! Because he's handsome. Yeah, I would. I would. Okay, let me just hit this. You'd be like, see okay. you, Daniel. I'm going with John Grisham. <laughs> <laughs> that poor little Daniel, if he only oh, knew. Oh, I know. Bless him. He's probably like, man, they're old ladies. We were, yeah, to him, we were old ladies. Okay, okay. That's okay. All right, so she's got hers, and now like we're going to do the eyebrows next. I like so I take just some of the brown paint, and I just kind of oh. stipple it on there. That's perfect. Okay. Sorry. Just on the edge. <laughs> Commentary from the peanut gallery. It's okay. But it's great. Look at that. Does she, Cindy? She makes it look too easy. <laughs> it is easy. It ain't, it ain't easy. <laughs> you live in a terrible place. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. 
Oh I'm choosing God. to have a cowboy with a dirty nose. So you're fine. Okay. Well, you know what? what? He's just been out with he's the cows. He's been riding. Exactly. Working. He's a hardworking man. Okay, so we're doing. So what we do? I lay my nose on there first, okay? Because you want to have everything basically the way it should be with the eyes, you know, next to the nose. So <laughs> oh, really? Because that's where they kind of go. Yeah, that's kind of where they go. So I just end up doing that, and what I end up doing is taking my paint and I roll a very thin brush in a circle. Can I be the reporter now? Certainly. Is there a reason why you roll it? Because you're the first person I've ever seen do that, I and I think it's. I, <laughs> I thought Cindy it was knows. so Cindy cool, knows. and I've never seen anybody else roll it like that. So could you explain yes. that? Because it makes it pointy. Okay, when you do it, and um, you want it to be very thin when you're doing your brush stroke for your eyes because you don't want it to be really thick and ugly. So you want it thin. So that's the reason. So I take this and I just kind of make. Which is going to make dry. me nervous. No. Okay, good. It's just that. Oh, me asking the question dry. dried your paint up. <laughs> no, it didn't have anything to do with it. So I have a certain way to do my eyes. Everybody's seen my eyes. And I want to do them your way. Because they're so good. I think I need a... Do you remember that artist that drew the little girls with the really big eyes? Yes. That's what, when I see Tanya's eyes, that's what it makes me think of is her eyes on her items always are... But the pop. first thing I see, they pop. And it's <laughs> like, I could probably pick nice. Tanya's artwork out because of her eyes so mm -hmm. to me that is a compliment and mm -hmm. that is i think it's really cool well, thank you yeah everybody's talking about you make the best eyes mm -hmm. i make the best eyes thank you so much okay so we're just doing two upside down use that's exactly right okay mm -hmm. he's like i got it mm -hmm. i can do an upside i have to trick my brain that way you know i have to do an upside down you not an eyeball I have to break things into the shapes. Too, I, I like, them. yeah, it helps my brain. Have you found that when you look at somebody's face, can you break it down into shapes too? Me? That's the way my brain works. Uh, I don't, no, not, I don't necessarily do that. When I look that's at, that's interesting. Like when I want, because I think that's why when I started painting, I was able to copy things because I can look at the picture mm -hmm. and I can see. Oh, I wish I had a circle, that. a square, a triangle. I can see all of that. I wish I had that. I don't so, know why I, don't I can have do that. that. That's I cool. I don't look at it in that tech, that way. Well, then I'm the weirdo of the bunch. No, but I would like to have right that, one, you know, too. that wouldn't be bad to have. How do yours always look so symmetrical? I don't know, aren't that great? Look at them. Perfect. Y'all. No. Precious moments. Oh, it oh yeah, does it look does. Like that is moments. what they remind me of. Yep. In a little bit, it does. Keen is the big eye artist. That's right. Yes. yes. That's it, because I, I think I had one when I was a kid. Well, don't you, do you remember the story about that? Her husband took credit for him for years. And That's she right. was at home painting these paintings. They made and, a movie about that. Yes, movie. Amy wow. Adams was in it. Okay. And he um, was taking all the credit and Just her make money. Make a circle. Make a circle. Mm -hmm. Someone suggested that you take Tanya's phone and come over here and show what she's <gasps> doing. That's a brilliant idea. Yes. Is, is it because I'm not working? That uh, Deb, means? we're about to do it on uh, Hummingbird Painery. I'm sorry y'all can't see up close. Yes, it, it's hard. Sorry y'all are seeing life. my hand right now. Did you go away? Uh-oh. We're, we're going to get her on Hummingbird Painery. And so hop over to Hummingbird Painery, and she's going to do the up-close view. I can't see what I'm... Do Nelda, it. that's a right, that's a good, they would like for you sometime to do a, I'll hold it right here while you paint. Just go. Okay. I got it. You get, okay. Is it the right angle? It is. It's right on there. I see it. All right. Okay. So the first thing I do, like Lindy said, is an upside down U and I make the shape of my eye. Okay. And then I take the black and you can do it over to the side if you want it to look to the left or to the right, or you can do it up and down or straight. Okay, so I went ahead and I did mine just in the middle. 
okay, because it's a cowboy, so you just want him to look normal. <laughs> so I'm going to make brown eyes because I did not bring any blue. And because Rip has brown eyes. And of course. I'm sorry, Rip. Lori. I didn't see it. I apologize. So we're going to take this and I go to the very bottom of the eye. And remember what I told you, if you've watched me on my page, I'll tell you that you have to make it a little bit bigger because the white and the black, you're gonna be able to fix any imperfections, okay? So you're just gonna go on the bottom portion of the eye and put a thick amount of the brown. And you wanna kinda go up just a little bit into the black. Okay. Ellie can't see the comment. Um, what is she asking me now? Opus says, Ellie, read comments. I can't read the comments and hold a camera. It's, uh, I, I'd be glad to try, but I'm really not that good. Okay, and so you've got to get the paint off of right your on. brush because you're going to do the white now. And I'm going to get some on my plate. And I'm gonna take it and we're gonna go on the bottom portion of the eye. So you wanna get as close as you can right here. And it doesn't matter if you go into the black, okay? Because you're gonna fix that. Amazing. You're just gonna kind of make it rounded at the bottom once you get this portion on. Remember I told you to do the outline first and you can make it as thick as you want there. I always have to, all right, you see? Oh, oh, okay. You got it? I see. So you just kind of fill it in at you the bottom. You fill it in at the a, bottom. With another U, you do the U inside the U. Makes right. Sense. Okay. And see, I just kind of go ahead and make the rounded portion at the bottom. I go into the black a little bit because we're gonna fix it. Try to go under the brown or the blue. I did blue on the one over here and I'll show it to you. No, you can't, Patty, you can't see the close up on mine. You can scoot over to Hummingbird Paintery and you that's where you'll see the close up. Um, my, my camera's over there and they want you at some point, Tanya, to do a live in your studio on eyes and bring it your know, camera over to the top. To I'll show you how to do it if you have the if you have the. Yo, this it's really cool seeing her do it. Yes, this close it is. I'm going into the white, okay, with a little bit of the brown. Oh, that looks great. Okay. Oh, that's so pretty. So once you get the eyes, it looks funny a little bit further out because you're going to put your nose here. See how much better it looks with the, the nose in between, okay? But we're going to put a few of the little lashes on and we're going to make this a little bit better, okay? It's going to come to life just a little bit more. <clears throat> I'm going to twist in my, my paint again. Thank you, sweet penny. And we're going to go into the brown just a little bit because you want to make it a perfect little circle for the black. And then you want to go steadily this way, which I'm not very steady, am I? Thank you, Lori. I, I'm sorry we can't. I'm going to show you mine, but truly go over to Hummingbird Paintery and see how she does these eyes up close. It's really cool. Yeah, jump over on her page right now. You can see it because that's what I'm doing. I'm right on it. Mm -hmm. Plus, I need to jump on over there and follow her. Anyway. Absolutely. That'll be a perfect opportunity to go on and uh, follow her page. So let me just show you where I am while she's doing that. I'll show you this on my tater bugging page. This is where I am. I'm just waiting on the next. I'm going to do this next step. I didn't even. I, I still don't have this in a good angle. What, what was this part you were doing? Yeah. Okay. 
it, you could even hold it up like this. That's kind of, yeah. Like yes, that. yes, that's per I know that's not easy on you. No, that's okay. Um, is that better, y'all? Well, they don't, they're on okay. That's right. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. Is that better, y'all? <laughs> Alright, so I'm did. barely taking my paintbrush. We can get replay it. her video on, or we can share it on our pages. Absolutely, maybe. yes. And you just because it's a cowboy, you don't want a bunch of eyelashes, okay? You just want, and I'm right handed, so I turn mine over. I do like, like a boy this. with long eyelashes, though. <laughs> And I just take it and do like little fuzzy. They can see, but I can't see anymore, so I don't know what I'm doing. She'll <laughs> have to give me private instructions Here. afterwards. That's okay. I just I take do. it and I just flick it out. But did I get, it. what am I missing you, on the eyes? Anything? You haven't, did you do the brown? I can see it, but it's really dark. Okay, I'll do, I'll lighten that up a yeah, little bit. Yeah, lighten it just a little. Okay. And okay. then when I go back over it, I take the whole black and I go down a little bit on that. I did a little bit of the brown on the white, okay, okay. to make it more smooth. Okay. See, because you can't see, it looks like you've got black and then just white. I gotcha, okay, so. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. So then, um, I'll get the black out of here, and then we're gonna get the white. And I let the white do its own thing. I put enough on the end of my brush that I can make just a dot. And if I make one just a little bit bigger than the other one, then that's okay. All right. So cute! So that's the way he looks. Now he still looks funny without his little brim here. Uh-uh, he's cute as he can be. He looks like Rip. <laughs> so oh, I love it. I, I love, love it. it so much. Look at that. He's, He's so, so cute. Adorable. Okay, I got to do some eyelashes on that. Send some hearts. <laughs> right, Pat? I agree. I agree. So yes, this is what give it her looks some hearts. Like. Oh, he's so precious. He's I hope y'all can see that. Let me go put him back up on yeah. that thing now. That's fine. You sure? Whatever you want to do. Whatever y'all want me to do. I'm taking orders. Okay, y'all, what do you want her to do? Did you do? Yeah, okay. All right, let me go to this side. It is making me sweat a little bit. Yeah, yeah. just put it down. Well, I'm going to put it back it. on your thing. Yeah, okay. You're going back to the, the stand. Is that good? You could even tilt it down just a little bit. I don't think it'll tilt. Oh, okay. I can't okay. figure out how to do that. Nope. It's like thick. Like, like, <laughs> sturdy. Is that good? Is Can I'm you? Just, yeah. Okay. I mean, I, yeah. Okay, Tanya, Miss Teacher, ma'am, mm -hmm. tell me where I am now on the eye process. What do What do I do next? Because mine are not nearly as cute as yours. What have mm -hmm. I? Yeah, did you wait. go back on the brown? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Is that not enough? Should I lighten it up a little bit more? I think it's okay. It's just that yours are darker than mine, but mine are still. Ooh, but if that? you look at Lindy's dark eyes, she's got really dark, dark brown eyes. So. That kind of looks good. like your eyes, Lindy Lou. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'll take it. There you go. Let's do this. There we go. All right. Now you got the little white dot there and there. Okay. I'm on it. And I just take it and let the brush do it. Yeah. Is that what you do too? Yeah. Okay. And do you always do your dots in the same spots or do you do them sometimes another way? Or? I do them sometimes different. Sometimes I don't do two dots. I only do one dot. Sometimes I do both of them. Sometimes I do just one here. I might put it on the left and the right. I don't know why. I just do whatever I do. You let the eyeballs tell you what they want to be. Yeah. Just like just let it. Yep. Let it speak to you. And I also use glue gel. Um, you can use, um, what is that? E6000. E6000. Um, or Gorilla Glue. You can use that to put it together and some hot glue to do it temporarily. Um, to, <laughs> and we're going to put it together. So what I do is put it where I want to, and then I take it and I put a little thin line of it, and then I put the hot glue 
on it and I try not to mix it because it will stink. Yes, a really bad stink. Right, let me see here. Do the same thing here. One little bitty bit and the other one. I think I want to mess with my doer. <laughs> I just know you. I love it. I think I'm see, Lindy's to... looks different than mine, and I like it. I, love I do yours. too. I love yours. I like how um, you will use the same paints too. That's what's kind yeah, of the neat exact about same it. Paints. He's got to have a little beardle action here going on. We got this done? Mm -hmm. I'm going to put it back and let it get hot. Yeah, the the lens lens can do it. Yes. And I always make sure that the sides go over this side because if you don't, then you're going to so see good. the back portion yes. of the head. So you want to put this on the oh, outer so edge. <laughs> but this is what it looks like. It's so pretty. Right here. And you can paint it however you want to, of course. I painted one before I got here, and this is what it looks like. I guess I didn't realize these were brownie points. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. So I've got two different kind of this. I did spray it with a clear coat, and that's the reason why this one is dull and this one is shinier. I'm going to do that too for Richards. So these are them. These are them. These are them. These, these are, are them. Are them. <laughs> Rip and Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin. Oh my gosh. That's so okay, funny. now I'm just playing. Oh, I guess I'll show y'all mine. Oh, yeah. Yes. So I did Uncle I love Sam, yours. and I like the rustic, um, different kind of style. I chose not to put eyes on mine, but I'm kind of wishing I had. But I <laughs> thought it fit better the way I did mine. So I just did those <laughs> darker. I'm going to come a little closer. The darker, more um, rustic looking colors. And of course, he's got a little bling. And I did some <laughs> rub and buff on. I don't know what they're saying about me, and I'm really a little nervous. I did some rub and buff and some stain on him. So mine just looks a little bit more like my decor. Oh, I so. Yeah, he's cute. I'm, I like him. Rustic. But that just goes to show you the different ways you can do these. And I might do a cowboy too and have a glamorous cowboy. I'm that, going to get blush. I think I need it. Yes, we need our blush. I didn't put any blush on here, and I that did put it on it. this one. It really makes it. I put the blush on here, so you can see it really does. It kind of brings out the whole face. Do you have a price on these yet? What you're selling them for? No. <laughs> okay. So I don't know. That's okay. I haven't really decided. You know, because it's a big piece of wood. Yeah. These are longer, so usually um, I charge 35. Unpainted? Unpainted. 35 unpainted. Yeah, 35 unpainted for the kit if you want just the outside, and it's just gonna come like this, okay? And you will be able to paint it the way you want it. And if you want it, you can do it like that, and Uncle Sam. Yeah, you can. These are two different cutouts, too. <laughs> I, I had not till I was wondering. Oh my word! Time. And I just saw the rubbin buff on it. Oh no, my word! I just word. saw the rubbin buff too. I love that. Well, I didn't no, like the stars. One of those the, too. What, yeah, I know. And I want to do a cowboy like this since I have Uncle oh, Sam. Wow. I want a cowboy yeah. too. Okay, so we've got powder. This is the one I've used before, and it's a cream. So just know oh, the wow. difference. Okay. Try whatever. Whatever. Mine's just that stuff from Dollar Tree. He's got a sunburn. I love the I love mm -hmm. the blush on it. That does look good. What do y'all think? Post them to our pages. Absolutely. Kind of like Colonel Sanders. Yeah, rhinestone cowboy Ellie. <laughs> That's exactly what I want to do. That's what I need is a rhinestone cowboy. Oh, that <gasps> Tanya, I'm gonna I'm gonna need to place my order. <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be so cool. Where are you going? I'm going to my heaven. 
date with my wife. <gasps> oh! Your wife looks ugly. Mr. T, tell her that's a lie. <laughs> Handle, make mine a handlebar mustache. Oh my gosh, that would be cute. That is too. cute. Oh my word, I might do it. I might just, that's kind of cute. Yeah, don't pay attention to me over here. <laughs> Isn't that cute? They're so stinking cute. They are cute. Okay. So uh -uh, Y'all don't get this. I'm sorry, I love you, but you're not getting <laughs> We can't have a brownie. You see my Uncle Sam? You know it's different. <laughs> Look at that, what's wrong with him? Isn't he cute? Not a thing. Like he just it. doesn't have eyes. Okay. Right. So I'm gonna put my hat on first. Mm -hmm. oh, and I end up just leaning it up. I just lean it up, put the stuff underneath it. Um, did you just do this hot glue or you want hot glue? Both. Okay. It has more. I don't know how much I can just do a little bit. You can fill in Here's the hot glue. Thank ma you. Oh, you're welcome. I'm happy to assist. Mm -hmm. Sorry, dear Bill. Give it to Richard for Father's Day. Yeah. Bill? Yeah. It's been my plan all along. Put a star in the middle of his hat and make him a sheriff. That's cute. That. I've got some more stars if y'all want them. You want a star? You want a star? You can do one. You don't have to. So Somebody's I mean, been in the brownies. I, I don't know who it was. It was not me. Somebody and what was are them my before I got them. Okay. Do you, you guys want stars? Yes, yeah, sir. I want a star. You have a bigger one than you have, or are they the same? Well, I have a bag with multiple stars, so let's just let yeah, you. I was going to say, I've got a bag of stars in. out there, too, in the studio. Yes. If you, you oh, other Well, I mean, this bag was $2.99, and then a small bag was $2.99 with like 10 of that size. I was like, who? who would Sherry wants a brownie. Sherry wants a brownie. I'll bring you one. There's plenty. <laughs> there are those little brownie bites, too, from whatever, oh, from Sam's in well, there. Is it supposed to be right there? That's cute. <laughs> that is so cute. <laughs> Y'all are cute. What color? It's about time yet. Okay. Oh, my God. Whatever color you paint it, you should put some rubber buff on it, and then it looks like a gold star. I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. rubber buff. You go ahead. You go Just use a smidge. Look at her, just a smidge. Have you ever used rubber buff? Yeah. Okay, I didn't know if you were converting you. Oh my gosh. Oh, look how so pretty cool. it is! It's really pretty. Tanya, I'm so proud of you right now. <laughs> she's coming into my evil ways. Oh no! She's coming into my evil ways, baby. She did. I brought her oh my gosh. Ways. That looks so cool. I love that. I love it. I'm feathering out my blush. Tanya lost her sound. Tanya, yeah, it's because my battery's low. Oh, ouch, I just about uh, those stars are from Hobby Lobby. Yes, Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby. Wood pal. Or yes, whatever that's. And they last a long time. I've had my stars for a year oh now. Gosh. So. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Oh, I love that. Do you want us to have on it, Sheriff? Yeah, I think it needs a little black outline, you know. <laughs> Y'all, these are cute. <laughs> She's like, oh my gosh. Yeah, this is a cute Sheriff. He's so handsome. Cowboy was a great idea, oh, Ellie. Yeah. You executed it beautifully, Tanya. It's, it's all about that mustache, man. All about that mustache, man. Mm -hmm. He looks like the Marlboro Man. Oh, he does. Some people may not even know what a Marlboro is. Tanya is channeling Ellie vibes. <laughs> it might not work with the wax slick. on there. It might be too slick. Yeah. You could probably take a Sharpie and do it later if you wanted to. Oh. Ooh, that brownie made me get feel like I just ate 100 pounds of sugar. Woohoo! Let's go <laughs> back to Sonic. <laughs> you ready? Sonic Tanya. Tanya. Oh my God, your hand is so steady. You <laughs> Not must have always. a steady hand. I'm in awe. 
I'm telling you. I bet Lori Gamby's got a thousand pictures of me staring at Tanya Penny <laughs> going like this. <laughs> <laughs> It, is it Sheriff Longmire? Oh, that's a good show. Have you watched that? Mm -mm. That's pretty good. I think that was a book, too. I've heard of it. What's it on? Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah. what, what mm -hmm. was it? Oh, you know. Maybe Netflix? Oh. There's so many streaming services yes, now I can't I know. keep up. Did you want to star, too, Lindy Lou? I'm trying to decide. I was going to hold him oh, up and I see. Oh, I like that mustache. You know, like that. <laughs> That's how my rhinestone cowboy's gonna go too. That is so cute. There he is, y'all. Let me bring him up close. He's so for you. cute. Here he comes. Here he comes. That <laughs> mustache. That's kind of cute, huh? Do I do okay on oh my the eyes? Gosh, my eyes good. aren't as good as Tanya's, but he's fine. Oh, I think he did great. <laughs> How do we do, y'all? Let's see, what time is it? It is. Oh, 5.15. Okay. Well, I always manage to go over, but... Not so bad, though, for three practice. Thank y'all. I definitely have to come to Memphis. It's fun mm -hmm. here, isn't it? Thank y'all so much. Mr. T says, come on. Y'all, come on. Um, After Tina gets through painting the star, we should all hold ours up together. And, yeah, and how and different they are. And then Lori can take a picture. That's perfect. She does. That's perfect. Lori, Look at me yes. telling Lori what to do. Look at Skip. Mm -hmm. um, but y'all, seriously, <laughs> head over and uh, follow Hummingbird Painery and Ellie's Attic. She's going to show you some of the stuff that oh, yeah. um, she has. That's a great H-E-R-I-F-F, yes. Sorry, I had to see it in my head. That's how I spell. My little typewriter goes. <laughs> <laughs> these are so fun. And you can, if you uh, missed it, you can order these kits from Hummingbird Painery. All you have to do is message her on her, I'm going to take these off now, on her page. And you can turn him into Uncle Sam. Well, let her know which one you want because Uncle Sam's hat is square at the top. Um, but then she's got, well, she's got a lot of cute animals. Are you sure? Is it two Fs? It's two yeah, R's, it's, right? It's only one R and Sheriff. One R and two Fs, I believe. Okay. Y'all help me, Sheriff. <laughs> S-H-E-R-I-F-F, -F, isn't that right? A bandana. Shut up. Stop Shut up. it. Oh my goodness. Y'all just have some great ideas. So if you get this kit, There's we have to see. Yeah. Tanya has a group. Um, Hummingbird Crafters. Is that what you're talking about? <laughs> Hummingbird Crafters. Oh, blank. Where you can post everything. Thank you, B. I sat next. Saturday's going to be fun. And y'all, we're doing something different. We are going <laughs> to snap that picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that always feels so funny when I do that. Oh my gosh. Uh, I love my check your mail, too. Darlene. Thank you. A uh, PO box or my regular yeah. mailbox. You just what? let me know. I love it. Um, it was so up when you did that. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. This is so cute. This, these are so much so fun. Cute. They're all different. I see? did this in my head last night when I couldn't sleep. I was like, I'm gonna paint it like I did my stage. <laughs> <laughs> I had it all in my head. Beautiful. Okay. Now wait, y'all. Oh, if you miss this, listen. Oh, look at this little. It's my favorite. The cutest it's thing my ever. Favorite. My little mouse and the cheese. This is what Lindy gave me. This circle piece. It's a frame, and I chose to do it as a mouse and cheese. Oh. Um, I also did a mouse and a cookie out of one that I made myself. Thank you for those hearts. I appreciate that. <gasps> the pig. Yes, and I have a, a pig to give away. If y'all saw the pig in the bathtub. <laughs> I love the pig. This was it, okay? It's not painted. And I will let Lindy pick somebody for this. Um, and I will send it to you. You can make your own. The little tub was from Dollar Tree. 
It has that garden flora or something like that written on it. Is that what it is? Yeah. It's and, so um, cute. I used some pom-poms that were large, um, and you can make your own of this. You can look on my page, and I did make it live. So you'll be able to see how to paint it. I've also posted a picture of it on there. So, um, you know, Lindy will pick somebody for this and you will get it. I will send it out to you. Cindy Kane, are you still here? You're my picker. <laughs> You're my like, picker, girl. You mean Cindy Kane's going to pick somebody. Um, did oh y'all notice the shirt I wore for the cowboy day? <gasps> I am not my idea. Did you think y'all would see that? Did you, uh, did you? Rips in the bag. There's what? Rip is in the bag. Oh, I thought you said, never mind. Uh, rip the bag. No. She's getting some more stuff. I'm just going to bring the whole, oh, yeah. Yeah, because, yeah, y'all, she that. does such beautiful stuff. So, you've got to go look at uh, Ellie's oh, Attic. Oh, he's so, and, he also looks like that other guy, the one that plays guitar. <gasps> oh, oh, oh I saw this so online, many. but oh, my, oh, my word. Girl. So this is wow. like a tabletop is what I used because <clears throat> this is just what I had from Lowe's. Um, it's like a 15 inch wide, I believe. And you like cut that. all those pieces. I did not cut the cowboy. I did buy the cowboy, but I did cut the yellow or the yellow, <laughs> the Y for the Yellowstone. And then I painted this and then put this on. I added all of this to it and I cut a little cowboy hat that I had in half. That way it would That sit. is amazing. That is amazing. So, just cute, right? I'm just amazed that she cuts her own stuff. I know. <laughs> I know. I wish I had a Gerald, though, because then it'd be a lot easier. It would be a lot easier. Can you put rip back? Yeah, you can put rip back. Oh, good. Okay. Sh Cheryl Nunn, is that correct? Um, you pinned the... Okay. I'll get it. I'll get it. We'll find out. We'll, we'll catch it up. Okay. Now this was from a Dollar Tree bunny rabbit, and I painted and I cut out the little feet. Okay, I for the it. bottom, I glued it to the bottom and then I painted it. This just the tail right here um, is out of felt, and then I added some little bling and the felt ears, and then I painted that. And my followers have seen this as well. This is just one of them. I did a cow and a pig and a little girl and a penguin something else I can't remember but they were all on my page during Easter and I've sold all so of them I, nobody wanted to buy this one because I, I really like her <laughs> <laughs> okay so I just couldn't hardly part with this but I mean I could make another one but anyway so but I love it and she's got painted pink toenails and Stop her fingernails it. are painted too are and, you her, and her fingernails <laughs> And her fingernails are painted. <laughs> I saw the fingernails at first. I, I, was like, uh -uh. I forgot I painted her fingernails. Oh, but this is just goodness. some little um, tool that I used for her skirt. So, so I just wanted, she doesn't have boobies, so I don't have to worry about that. <laughs> so anyway, this is some <laughs> But I love her. She's That's my, she's she my favorite. That's what she says Exactly. So, oh, I love her. Can so you put it back in the back? Mom yes. collected mice, and my brother collected pigs before he passed. Aww. Love Tammy's little animals. Uh-oh, my battery's done. I know. My battery's, my battery's about dying, too. I got it. I got it. For sure. We got to tell you. For sure. Oh, the, yeah. On the laptop. So if my something. phone dies, everybody from Hummingbird Paintery, I'm sorry. Um, but we're about finished anyway. It's actually just my laptop. It ain't gonna hurt the. It All was right. funny to watch you sprint across the room, though. Was <laughs> I know it really was. <laughs> okay. All right, y'all. So hope you enjoyed this today. Um, I'm sorry it's a little bit yeah. further away, you know, from the actual camera. But this is what we did. Yay! Thank you, Tanya. This was so fun. So much fun. Thank you, Tanya. So, so I had um, a lot of fun. Elizabeth, tell them a little bit about uh, your whole, our whole vision for Memphis Bells and what's happening next Saturday, and then we'll let them free. We're having a crafting event. Is that what they're called? Crafting live event mm -hmm. next Saturday. It's going to start at noon Central Time, and we have six or seven wonderful creators back to back. We have a little bit of a break in between. We did that more for the creators because we have some newer creators. 
Our next one, we may just go straight back to back, but we did it this way because we didn't want anybody getting freaked out because they only had an hour to do their craft and getting, you know, all messed up. Mainly me is who we're talking about. <laughs> it's me. Um, but we're gonna, what we wanna do with this group, and Lindy and I have talked about this. Months. Months, yeah. Um, we want a sweet little circle of friends for people to come into and to help out people that are new. I'm still new. Tanya's still relatively new. Um, we want to have a way for people to get in a group of women, or not just women, creators that are like-minded and want to help support each other. So that's our goal is to help grow other women whether they're at 25,000 followers or 2,000 followers. We want to help get them to the next spot. I mean, or 250 followers, whatever right. it is. We want to help people grow to what they want it to be. And um, we're also affording an opportunity each time we have an event to one of our followers. And we are, Sweet Opa is going to be our guest crafter this, this time. I think and that's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Okay. It's, a, it's a patriotic theme. And we named it after Memphis because we're, we're from all, Memphis. Mm -hmm. We're all from the Memphis area, and we are very proud of that. So that's kind of what it is, and I think this is going to morph. We don't know what it's going to turn into. We've got, of course, Lindy and I have already got big plans, but we've got to get through this first event first. So but hard. to be clear, it's not just for people in right. the Memphis area. Please don't think that. it's That's just our, our kind of our core group. But yeah. then we want everybody that wants to be involved to be involved. So right. please join the group, uh, Memphis Bells Creative Circle. Yeah, and we want you in to, the reason we have the group is because you can watch this event by going to each one of our pages, but we also want to have a place where somebody can just watch each person in the same venue mm -hmm. for the five or six hours that we're having it. So that's why we did this, so that you can log into the Memphis Bell Creative Circle and just follow it all day Absolutely, long. Absolutely, yeah. It's, it's completely up to you. If you decide you don't want to do it that way, you can go to my page, you can go to Lindy's, you can go to Tanya's, you can just follow it however you want to. So, yeah, hop, hop. Yep. Um, Janet came in a little late. She wants to see what we made. Tanya from Hummingbird Paintery cut these out. We've got Uncle Sam and we've got a cowboy and you can get those from Hummingbird Paintery um, just by messaging her. So that's what we did today in case you're coming in late. Um, yeah, Cheryl won the pig. So Cheryl oh, Nunn gets your pig. She's very excited Yay. about it. And uh, we're excited about next Saturday. It's going to be called Patriotic Party. And we've got uh, more information coming on that soon. And so, yeah, give these two ladies a follow for sure. They are awesome. And um, if you don't follow me, I would love for you to follow me too. <laughs> Here at Tater Buggin'. And, um, yeah, that's it for today. Are we, we good? I think we're good. Yeah. Any I'll... questions, anybody? Bye, y'all. I'm giving them just a second, just in case. I think we're good. Hearts, hearts, hearts. Y'all are wonderful. Thank you for the Thank hearts. You. I appreciate Bye. it. Thank you. Bye-bye.